choices. The Hinges of Destiny See, Georgie here made an important one that day. Stranded in Tarkov for over a year, it was apparent that whatever he was doing, he was doing right. He was still alive. Every day would start the same. Before a shot of whiskey, Georgie would clean his guns, eat a can of questionably delicious beef stew, ferociously rubbing his teeth with freshly picked wheatgrass afterward, and finally, he would go out. Every day, the same path. The one that he'd come to know well. He hadn't thought of changing much of anything, as every day, he would find something he'd previously walked by, or someone. <laughs> the bottom line, he had a pattern. A pattern that worked out every time. The one that saved him more times than he could count. However, one thing was different that morning. Georgie was out of beef stew. The first raid of the day was as smooth as they come. My buddy eliminated Sturman with a shotgun while I was over here missing all my shots. Let's just say he was compensated for having to carry me through this. He got himself a Red Rebel. Feeling empowered, I marched on to finish my quests. Soon after, I was presented with an opportunity. And so it began. A true marksmanship challenge. The most challenging terrain would be customs. With very limited open areas with high ground, I needed to think about my shots in advance. I grabbed my T-5000 and tried to get a position where I could snipe across the construction yard. I wanted to have at least some cover, but the spot I was going to, I couldn't stay very long if I wanted to get out alive. I chose the office building as my next spot. And then, things got interesting. Let's face it, dude. I'm just gonna be sitting here for the next 35 minutes. Not gonna see anyone. My self-confidence is gonna go down. Hello. So, you got... No? Okay. Thought he was gonna loot the jacket, but... Oh, <gasps> no. He's gonna extract. Okay. I'm done. Okay. Goddamn Ruskies. One down, two to go. The rest of the raid was silent. I grabbed his stuff and moved to extract. I didn't want to waste any time, so I jumped back in. Only to find out that I might be going back to the lobby right away. Just end it. Like, right now. Dude, he's been running around like a maniac. I think he's teasing me. Alright, here goes. Okay. Alright. That's the deal. Well, I don't got a shot for a hundred, but maybe some loot. Sounds like they're geared. That's an M4. Is 
Sound is a bit buggy, but... Hey, what you doing outside? All right, I could... Hmm, I got an idea. Now, I don't know if this is a hundred meters, but it sure looks like it. I think it is. Oh, wait. Oh, he didn't even... I don't think he knows that guy's there. Shit. That's not a hundred meters, no way, but... Whatever. You got nothing to lose. Alright. Yeah, that's not a hundred meters. I should go get his stuff. Now let's go back. You know what? I could check for the rest of the gear. They probably tossed around, but ah. Well, close but no cigar. The shot was 95.5 meters, which means that technically the raid flopped. But I did get some loot out of it, so it was a win. Be that as it may, I tried again. This time I wanted to catch him off guard early. Oh my god. Dude. Alright. By now, everyone knows I'm here. Or not. Dude, what is with these raids? Come on. Alright, one more, one more. Just one more. Georgie wandered the wasteland aimlessly, desperate to find the beef stew. The one thing that reminded him of home. Today was the first time he'd ever strayed from his usual route. It didn't feel good. But Georgie knew that was the only way to find the precious spam. It truly is astounding how difficult we sometimes deal with change. With one snipe left on customs, I needed a break. Enter reserve. And what do you know? High ground it is. I had to be fast and catch the players moving towards the center of the map. 150 going once. I couldn't spot anyone, so I used this time to check the ranges and zero my scope. I gotta wait on him. I'm not sure this is gonna work, but... Oh my god. Bastard. Dude, what a shot. That was amazing. Thank you, sir. I think he was doing the same thing. Ooh. How did you see? Okay, never mind. That 
that guy had a scope, I'd be dead. Piece of meat. Give me that beef stew, my dude. Alright, let's go out. I think... Wait, isn't this on already? The first one was out of the way. And I considered myself to be lucky, because I got the same spot twice in a row. Dude, I couldn't be happier right now, because I'm here. I know it's a dangerous spot and everything, and like... There we go. Every other person has a thermal, but come on. Love those, uh, love the glasses glitch. Two out of three. Dude, it's totally doable, this raid. Check that out. Dorms, I think. No! Oh my god. Just a bit shy of his head. It's two dudes. I ain't getting the same shot twice. They're crawling. Okay. There we go. Even if that's a scab, let's just, uh, let's confirm the range. 250 going once. Send it! Oh my god, that was a player! Woo! Is this your warfare? Wow. You should try better! <laughs> Holy shit! Scab looting? Wait, did I get him? I think I got him. No. Got him now. All right. Well, we got the kills. Holy shit, dude! All right, loot the first guy. Hope he's got water. If not, let's go to uh, the night buildings and try to find some. Definitely looted the mark room. The beef stew saves the day, bro. Where'd they go? Let's just do this for a second. Yep. They're right there. player scabs oh it's on whoa key bonanza what the hell nice scabs here no way, man. So, in two raids, reserve was off my list. I wanted to keep the ball rolling, so I set out to the great beyond. Woods. Let me just get the second kill over here. So I can, like, move with this loud-ass cannon. Yeah, yeah. Now you go silent. Screw it. This is a bad idea, I know. Yo, even if I lose it, 
I got it as a quest reward, so, uh... Whoa! Oh, that was nice. Oh, they're fighting. Okay. Oh, the snake died. Where are you going? Loot. Hey! That's the golden rule. You kill someone, you loot right away. You don't you don't wait, you don't go away, you just loot. Secret recipe to success in Tarkov. By fair. Oh, he's hurt. Where are you running off to, buddy? I think he was dropping gear. Okay, here's a pro tip. Don't ever go to this spot without a suppressor. I knew it from past experiences, but I did it anyway, so yeah. Alright, let's be honest, I had that coming. I went back in. Same map, same spot, different weapon setup. This is super sketch, but come on, bro. Two raids in a row. No way they're gonna find me. Plus, I got a suppressor now, so I'm good. You know how it goes. That looks like a player. No! Oh, that was a Matrix moment right there, my friend. Dude. He's lucky. Doesn't even know it. I don't think I'm gonna get the same chance again, but... I don't think he knows what actually happened, so... If he's, like, in a fight with someone... Let's just go 300. Oh! Okay. 250 it is. Yeah, buddy! Okay! Dude! Dude, we got woods! Holy shit! Oh! Oh, it feels good. Hello. Don't look back. Keep on rolling. Sorry about that. After hours of walking and searching, Georgie couldn't tell where he was. He'd never been so close to shore, and so close to danger. A signal tower silhouetting in the distance made him feel uneasy. He kept on. He could almost taste the beef stew again. Leave the classroom, returning home where their mother still loved them. This the. Is pretty over. Uh huh. Oh, wait. It's a brother. Eee, you don't even know. Oh, oh! Now I've put the most. Jam pa. Ima ih još. Dvojice još. Ja sam unutra. Špičku materinu više. Where are you looking? Wait... There's a map on it. Where is 
Drugi pao. Yes. Z zeleni kamion, onaj na mostu pored onih kola. I treće gotovo. Uuu, uh, dobio. Reči da si tri. Kakav si uspjer. This building strenuous to me hiding in corners and tangled so slowly. It was almost done. One shot away from completion. But you know this one? This one had to be loud. Hello, 1 800 head eyes. You called? Let me bring the thunder. Setting loans, I follow the only routine I have offered. Dude, no way they were faster than me. I was watching the whole time. What the hell? Construction? Hey! No, go back! Bro! That was dirty! Holy shit! Okay. We are coming, you hear? You know what? I'm just done, man. I'm just done for the day. My dude. Thank you. Nice shot. Thank you. Holy crap, dude. I wasn't expecting this. I mean, I was going for his head, but... Damn, it feels good. Let's just go. Turn it in. Sit in our stash for a while. Just watch this beautiful rifle. Collect dust for a bit. Oh! That was unfortunate. Okay, that's random. Oh, look at him, goddamn pussy! What are you doing here? Alright. Okay. First time this is open for me, bro. Huh. Hell yeah. And come on. Here you go. Sometimes we go forward and hope for the best. So did Georgie. He walked that green mile like a champ. Feels but see, Georgie made a choice. Yes, we all make choices. Good ones, bad ones, doesn't really matter. What matters is owning up to those choices and the potential consequences they may bring. And of course, damage control. So, what about Georgie's damage control? I like to think that he was angry at first, mainly because the poor soul never saw it coming. But then he shook it off and had the best raid of his life. I like to think so. Woof woof, eeyawky! Remember Lassie? Remember Lassie? Yeah. Woof woof woof! But maybe it's better this way. That Georgie doesn't know what really went down. Sometimes, you know, ignorance is bliss, my friends. Ignorance 
is bliss. Nice. <laughs>